Hey, what's happening? James Canzanella here, and awesome to have you. Thanks for coming around my neighborhood. Very cool to have you. And what I'm going to be going over in this video is how to pretty much use ClickFunnels with ClickBank, one of the most affiliate websites or networks or whatever you want to call it. They have a ton of different offers to promote. It's going to be completely up to you, so regardless of what niche you're in. And the reason why I created this is because it reminds me of a blog post I did, uh, uh, I'd say about a year back, maybe two years about when I first started, I had no idea what the hell I was doing. I actually went out and bought Google AdWords. Like that's seriously, <laughs> I, I really had no idea and I just wanted to get started. I wanted to test it out. So all I did was create a squeeze page, send traffic to it and I remember immediately making a sale and I go, wow, this really isn't as difficult as I was making it out to be. But the fact of the matter is to get to that point, you need to get started as quickly as possible. You gotta kind of throw away all these all this bullshit that's in your head about, oh, I don't know this, I don't know that, uh, I, I don't know what's gonna happen if I do this. The fact of the matter is that when you get something out there and you just do it, then you adjust. People are always looking to solve problems before they even get anything out there. And if you can eliminate that completely, you're gonna be doing much better than you were doing nothing, trying to figure out what's gonna be happening uh, if you don't you know, get moving and what the problems are going to occur. So starting lightning fast, that's what this is all about, okay? Also got a link down below for a ClickFunnels trial so you can actually get started lightning fast. You can go out, do this, uh, pretty much use it for a 14-day trial. I also got some bonuses and so on and so forth. This is going to be very easy, okay? So in ClickFunnels, all we are using is a simple one page lander, squeeze page, lead capture page, whatever the hell you want to call it. One page, that's all we're using, okay? Don't tell me this is difficult. It's not. I right, edit page in classic editor because I'm a classic type of dude. All right. So first and foremost, we don't want the name. Okay. Unless you're doing webinars, unless you really need the name of someone, it's going to, for the most part, decrease your conversions. Okay. So what I'm going to be doing, let's just say we're going to be presenting or presenting, um, offering up the Venus Factor, okay? Venus Factor was an extremely crazy hot offer. I don't know how crazy or hot it is anymore, but I remember promoting it and doing very well on Bing specifically. I also ran something just like this, but I had to use HTML and that pretty much sucked uh, a lot. Let's just say that, okay? So... What I'm gonna do first is just kind of edit this. Let's just say it's going to the Venus Factor, which is a weight loss uh, offer for women. It's a presentation. So something at the top could be like free presentation. And I don't remember what it's all about. So I'm just gonna put something that's usually going to either be in the headline or the kind of the text or the body copy of the sales letter or the sales presentation. What you wanna do is get kind of like the juiciest thing and you kind of wanna make it so they don't know what it is. If you say like, hey, lose two pounds by eating carrots. They're like, what the hell is this shit? I'm not watching that. <laughs> it's as boring as hell. So what you wanna do is make it kind of, what's the word, mysterious, okay? Like the one, you always see this all the time, the one weird trick used to, I don't know, banish stubborn body fat, you know, without, giving up your favorite foods. I'm not saying use that. That is just completely random, okay? Like I said, I would actually go to the sales video or sales letter and use something that's related to it, okay? It's all about congruency, okay? So let's just, there we go. And this isn't going to be a download free report, so it would be like, click here to continue. Okay, this stuff you can always edit. I'm just gonna keep that there to make this video quicker. Enter your best email address or enter your primary or enter your favorite or enter your, your number one. And of course, aside from that, you could keep it like this with the background. I just happen to go to a stock photo page searching for fitness and anything that's gonna kind of be related to you know weight loss, uh, like something like this could work, something like this. It's really up to you if you want to use a picture like that or keep it blank. I'm just gonna go here. Let's copy image address. Let's go here, let's go to settings. Then we can go to the background settings and let's just paste that in. Very cool. Let's hit save. Okay, we gotta do one more thing, almost forgot. So let's say we're at the marketplace, search for Venus. We got the Venus factor. <laughs> New 2016 update. Hmm, I don't know if that's been updated as uh, very recently to say the least. Anyway, let's go to promote. Let's pretend that her nickname is Venus. 
Let's get our non-affiliate link, which is our affiliate link. Okay, so this is important. This is why you only need one page. You go to settings, you go to, where is the redirect? Redirect override, let's paste that bad boy in there. So what that means is that normally in ClickFunnels, if you have any type of page after this, what happens is if they opt in or they click like the next button and it goes to the next page, it'll just go to the next page. However, if there's nothing else there, or even if there is a page after this, this is going to pretty much say, no, don't go to the next page. It's gonna redirect override pretty much and send it to wherever you want this link to go. Hope that makes sense, okay? And let's just pretend that for email, you know, uh, they got something, actually, we won't even put anything in there. I'll just hit save, okay? So let's hit back or exit. Okay, so here we have it. They land on your landing page, free presentation, the one weird trick used to banish stubborn body fat. I still have my super duper email at gmail.com in here. So let's go ahead and use that one. Click here to continue. And what do you know? It goes straight to the Venus factor. Okay. The Venus factor is a pause this. Okay. We don't need to listen to that. Okay. But do you see how like quick that was? Notice how I, what was that? Five minutes. Obviously I would need to add, you know, the, let's go back and open this up, you know, privacy policies. You can find those online, whatever terms of service, obviously you would need to send traffic to it. But I mean, the fact of the matter is that a lot of people will spend like a decade on this. They're like, oh, I don't know exactly what to use on my headline. Oh, I don't know what to use on the button here. Oh, I don't know what affiliate offer to use. The fact of the matter is, yes, you can do some research into it. Anytime you're looking to promote an offer, you can go to ClickBank or you can go like to a CPA network and ask managers to say, hey, what is converting right now? What is a hot offer? With ClickBank, just look at the gravity. If a lot of people are promoting it, then it's going to, you're going to be knowing that it's at least selling a good amount. Okay. It's not a clear cut thing, but if a lot of people are promoting, it's probably doing pretty well. That's another thing when it comes to any type of competition. If there's a lot of people in a market or an offer, that's a good thing because that means there's money to be made. People are always looking for these diamond in the rough niches where it's like, oh, no one's ever promoting this. I'm like, listen, do you know how many people are online? Do you know how many people have had that same thought that you did? All right. Unless you're planning on creating the next Apple iPhone, that's cool. But for the most part, stick where the money is, health, wealth, relationships, you're going to be good to go. Okay, so that's literally how you can get started really fast. You would also just need to integrate your email autoresponder. I didn't do that because mine's already hooked up and I don't need to add my super duper Gmail email onto that. But either way, that's how you can go and get started. Traffic sources, you can use Bing, you can use Facebook, you can use Facebook groups, you can use YouTube, you can use Twitter, you can use Instagram, you can use any of the social medias, you can do solo ads, depending on what you're going to be selling. Uh, that's going to be another video, but just kind of giving you an idea. Like I used to do this with Google AdWords, did well for the time that I ran it. And I remember having this follow up that was like 80 emails or something. I was so proud of myself. But the fact of the matter is just take fast action and then recoup get a look at the data, see what's going on, and then you can change things around. People always do it the other way around where they're looking to change things around and they never get anything done, okay? You can't have any type of success if you never do anything. That's just like the, the worst way about going and doing things, okay? Do a ton of shit, mess up, and then fix it, okay? Have I got that point across enough? Awesome, All right? So either way, James Gensnell, thank you for watching. Got the ClickFunnels links down below. If you want to use this to get started as fast as possible, promoting ClickBank and any other type of offer that you like. Want some more trainings like this? Feel free to subscribe. You can hit that notification bell so I can really annoy you every time I update a video. And aside from that, that's it. Thank you for watching. I'm James Gansanella. I will talk to you soon.